Hello guys, it's Razorland Zombies here, and Treyarch just released this kind of trailer slash video for Dies and Jock, and I think it's really cool. So I'm going to analyse some of it, but let's just show you the video first. Here we go. The road is long and dark, but I know where we are going. I, we, will complete our mission. I know you have questions, but you have to trust me. I have seen things you wouldn't believe. Things you couldn't even imagine. Richtofen claims knowledge of worlds beyond this realm. Do you believe this is possible? for my soul. So here we see Richtofen staring at the dog as it's going to unearth its um, owner, it seems like. Pretty interesting shot there. So it seems like Richtofen's actually staring at the painting of the Apothecans attack in a castle where the knight's shield is down by the bottom of the castle or before the mountain. And it seems like he's kind of staring at it quite intently. So maybe that's just like foreshadowing something that we're going to have a complete fight with the Apothecans. So it might, it might be interesting, but there is actually a quote from Richtofen where he says something along the lines of it was a battle that could never be won. So it seems like if we do fight the Apothecans, maybe that's foreshadowing that premise will fail. Could somebody tell me what the hell is wrong with the Gorgon in this shot? Just look at it, it just looks so weird. The fireboat actually doing damage to the zombies. That shot was just fucking awesome. The void bow actually doing damage. What the hell is going on with the Cuda? Why has Richtofen dropped his gun and seemingly like he's letting the zombies come and take him? Very interesting. I don't really know what's going on with that, but it is just a really interesting shot just seeing all these zombies kind of come towards Richtofen unarmed. That was fucking incredible.